too, man. If you couldn't tell what I was doing, blind disc golf, sorry I lost my voice. It's kind of hard to talk. I'm sorry if you can't hear me. But this is one of the longer throws on the course in Lakeport, California. I don't remember what hole it is. Like 12 or some shit. Or 11. I don't know if you saw it, my first throw went to shit. And it went way in the air like I didn't want it to. I wanted it to fly flat. <coughs> So, we're over here somewhere. Hey. Fuck. Uh, this is another thing, disc golf. You lose your fucking disc quickly. If you don't watch where they land, you're gonna fucking lose them. And I didn't watch where it landed. Motherfucker. I'll come back when I find it. Found it on the opposite of these branches. We're gonna go off our second throw, <clears throat> which is over there by that little tree. We'll be back when we get over there. In the area that it landed. And I know it landed like you know, right out in the open. I hate losing my voice, it sucks. There it is, right? Right there. That was a bad throw. Alright, so the hole's on the other side of that. So, this is gonna be weird holding a camera throwing at the same time, but we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna switch discs, because this one's not my favorite disc for throwing. It's kind of just like a secondary, I guess you could call it. Yeah, no just self. Don't throw with your disc off back on. It's not gonna work. I don't know if you can see it. It just went over there in the grass and then it just rolled in circles. There's people over here, so I'll be back to you when I uh, get ready to throw again. Okay, they're going up that way, so we're good. I mean, we don't have anybody behind us right now, so. We'll take our time, but the hole's right there. I don't know if you can see it. There's a little chain right there. And we landed right here. So, terrible throw. We're going to throw at the mid range. Terrible. We're going to throw again. They have another mid range. Oh, yeah. I need a GoPro for this shit, I swear. That's a lot better. I'm in there. Right up next to the hole. Hopefully you can see it. Right, I'll see you when I get back to the spot. There's the goal. And my just right next to it. And my third throws or my fourth throws, whatever. Uh, I'll grab this and just easy. Easy peasy. Just walk down this little path, and that was number 11. Mm -hmm. Those people keep walking up, they're not doing all 18 courses, I think, because they got a, a child and a stroller. So, 
again, I'm sorry for my voice. I mean, it's terrible, I know. All right, so we're gonna... Next goal's out there. I don't know if you can see it very well. Um, I can zoom in on recording. Oh yeah, I can. Yeah, you can barely see it. It's right, right, right there. How do I see back up? Oh god. Oh god. Oh no. Okay, we're good. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab our discs. A long range driver. That's our favorite one. We're gonna take you back over here. Put in my bag. Down like that. And we're gonna do this. Come around the back side. I'm gonna set you up. Like so. Oh, maybe. Maybe. The drink. There we go. Literally about to throw in my disc or my phone phone. I'm like, motherfucker. It was the wind. The wind knocked over, unfortunately. Let's see if we can get this to go again. Hopefully. Hopefully you can see. If it falls over, I'm sorry. That's what I try to do. That's what I get for trying to be cool. I try to be with it with the kids, I guess. I fucking trip on this little root sticking out the damn ground. Uh, hopefully you can see pretty well. I don't know. We still have nobody behind us, so we're good to take our time and talk like a weirdo. And sound like prone drugs or something, because my voice is fucking gone. But hopefully you can see that. Uh, that was a really, that was one of my better throws today. Um, we landed in the green, you would say, or like, yeah, I don't know, in golf terms. I mean, this is disc golf, but it's not like regular golf. I mean, the scoring is still the same, and like, there's bogeys and pars and birdies and shit like that. But I landed like, on like, where the hole is, basically. You know that, like, fuck, you know what I mean. The green area where the fucking hole is, if you land on that. Not like the fairway, but like the green, I guess. I don't fucking know. I don't play golf. I play disc golf. Failure. <laughs> so, there's a basket, number 12. And we flew right over the top of it. We got really, we got relatively close to actually making that on our first shot, which I have never made a hole in one. I've made a superb birdie, which was like, I threw it from the starting point, from the drive, from the flat, and it like hit a tree like two feet out, and I just said, fuck it, I'll throw it from there. And then I threw it, I threw my putter, and it was like way, the goal was way down the hill, like really far away, and I, co I couldn't even see it, that's how far away it was. And I just threw it down the hill, next thing you know, I hear chains ringing, I fucking got that amazing birdie, which was basically all in one, because like I was right next to the fucking starting point, but whatever. So we landed right there, really not too bad. We're gonna throw our putter. Hopefully get a good angle on this shit. Oh, that's what we like to see. So that, ladies and gentlemen, is called birdie. Cause this hole's a par three. Yeah, cause like if you take one shot to get a distance, a good distance, and then you get up on next, right next to it, and you try to make it on your third shot. Par, th par three. There's a spider web, I killed it. Uh, so we got a bird. Really nice. I, that's a lot better than I did yesterday. Uh, yesterday, I think on this, I got like a four, so I got like a bogey on this hole. Okay, I'm sorry if it was really choppy or something. That was weird. 
I just paused the record. No, it's still fucking choppy. All right, maybe we'll end this episode. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this. Okay, I mean, hopefully it's fine. Hopefully.